Hiya and welcome to a Nut Goes Nerd tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to use the onion skin effect and layers in Adobe Flash. So you need to go ahead and open Adobe Flash. This is Adobe Flash CS3 Professional. Okay, so now I'll just select and fit to window. So, uh, say I want to do an animation of a man walking with an orange background. Um, I'll go ahead and make a, a square as the orange background, and then um, I'll go and draw the man on it. My pen, change the colour of it. So then I'll go and draw the person. and then I'll press F7 for the next frame and the orange background will have disappeared but if I just remove that frame and undo the brush oops. right yeah I'll just go ahead and open a new project so um, now I'm going to show you how you can keep that orange background using layers. So um, I'll just set the colour to orange and now I go and put the rectangle as the background. And like I say if you press F7 to insert a new frame now that orange background will disappear unless you click on this little button here which says insert layer. Click on that and now layer 1 is the orange background and you can draw on layer 1 by using layer 2 so I will go and draw my man and now I press F7 to insert my new frame but now I can't remember where that man was stood because I've not got a very good mind so now I can press this little tool here called onion skin and then you very faintly see the last slide so then you can use that or you can see the outline of the man on the last slide but I'll just use that I can draw around him I'll make him wave I won't, I'll keep him walking. Press F7 and you can see the past two frames. And it does it for like the next three frames. So, um, I'll keep doing this for a while and then um, I'll come back to you once I've finished the animation and show you what the effect is. Okay then, so I've just made a couple more frames. I've made about ten more frames of the man um, going off the screen. And as you can see, you can still see the onion effect here of um oops fucking just keep the printer of like the past frames of the man and the background has stayed the same in all the different frames by the layers. So now I'll go to file and whoops file pre publish preview and flash and then there is my animation. Sorry, it looks pretty weird because of the, um, like you can still see the man on different frames. That's because the video card for my computer is pretty old and it doesn't work very well, the Camtasia. That obviously wouldn't happen when you're using Flash. It's just that the way Camtasia works on my computer. Alright, so that was a Nut Goes Nerd tutorial on how to use the onion skin effect and layers. Oh yeah. Also, the onion skin effect works with text as well, so if I just insert a new frame and then put some text on it. Bring that down a bit. Say, not. And then press F7, you can still see not there with the onion skin effect of the text. So, um, comment, rate, subscribe, do all that crap, and I'll see you next time.